So moving on to favourite scene. Oh, hang, on have... now. Oh, go... hang on now. Hang on. What? I am not skipping off over my other favourite aspect of this film. Go on then. It gets better every time I watch the film. I think you know where I'm going. Hart Buchner as Harry Ellis. Yeah, I've got a point on this. Yeah, so go on. He is, right? I think it's the performance, right, of Hart Buchner. I, I think he's almost up there with Alan Rickman as my favourite performance in the film. The scene where he... The, not only decides to go to Hans Gruber, but he actually gets in the office, he sits down, and he does that, Hans, Booby, I am your white knight. <laughs> and he does that grin. That is... I am, um, so... That I makes I, me laugh I, every time. I think the, the guy, yeah, who plays him, does it amazingly well. But I got a question, right? And okay. I think I know the answer to this. But is Ellis a cock? Oh, he's a, yeah, he's not. <laughs> he's a complete knob. I hate to work with him. He's like 100%, you know, that typical 80s Wall Street trader oh. type you know, uh, character. Do you know one of our, um, one of the guys that comes on here often, Adam, he's always on about, you know, he's on always on about those fucking coke fueled characters from the 80s because... You know, Hollywood in the 80s was always on coke. This is the perfect embodiment of that. The Harry Ellis character is coke in the 80s. Uh, and he's just he's sleazy as fuck. He's trying to hit on Holly Janeiro all the time. And it, even when John McClane is there, he's trying to, like, rub in the fact that she's successful and she doesn't need him and all this. It's just, he's he's so a cop. Dick. He's a dick. <laughs> Hans, Bobby, <laughs> I'm your white knight. He's so funny. I love him. Like, I love him. <laughs> he's brilliant. And that scene where he's like, I, it's one of my favourite scenes, so I, th I think we can move on to it now. It, it's not my favourite scene, but it's close. It's where he's trying to talk John McLean into giving himself up. And the power dynamic shifts between... Ellis and, and Hans Gruber and that the realization on Ellis when like fuck I'm I'm dying there, but he still like takes a sip of the coke and stuff before he goes and that's... when he's yeah when he's on the phone to John and he's like Ellis you know um you know stop this these guys will kill you blah 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 and you can sort of see it drain out you know away from him kind of his face there's a bit of a Deeming moment for Ellis as well in that scene because Mac John McLean at first is worried that he's given Holly up. He might have given Holly up, but Ellis actually says, "No, I've said that we were friends." Yeah. So he, he's not a complete wanker, is he? Yeah, he hasn't gone and said, um, "Yeah, that's his that's his wife over there." Different surname, <laughs> but that's his wife. <laughs> 